Huawei cherished its membership of IDOD very much because it had brought great values to Huawei. ITOD is an important branch of ITU. It deals with uh, regional development. It brings latest technology, standardizations, and regular policy together made by key sector and our sector to benefit the countries and regions around the world. You can see from background, our latest vision is bring digital to every person, home, and organization for a fully connected, intelligent world. Such a vision can be implemented only through synergetic collaboration from all interested parties around the world on a platform like ITUD. So we are very honored to be able to join some very important activities and strategic initiatives by ITUD. One of the latest such initiatives is Connect to Recover. We are now facing an unprecedented challenge for all human beings on this planet, COVID-19. We believe ICT technology will play a critical role in combating this pandemic. And also, ICT technologies in the form of standardization, regulatory policy, and regional development through the collaboration of all the three sectors, uh, PRD, will play a very central role to enable the human beings to cope with COVID-19 and to live and work together in the new normal. I think it was very successful ICT development. It requires a number of things. So you must have uh, excellent technologies, very successful regulatory policies, and also you have some channels, platform, and tool to bring all these things to local regions and the countries. To combine them is local industry and economic development. So I think from Huawei's point of view, we are one of the leading ICT technology player in the world. In our understanding, so industry and the private sector can play an important role in all those things. First, in standardization. I think ITT has been quite successful in many things, laying the foundation for the telecommunication and other ICT technologies, especially in certain number of study groups, which have been developing very popular, wide deployed technical standardization. Industry can play a central role by bringing their latest technologies, latest requirement, and more important, to contribute the talents, the standard people. In the case of myself, I'm the chair of that 16 ITUT. So I get the full support from my employer, Huawei Technologies, and we contribute our time, energy, wisdom to the work of standard building. In regulatory policy, we think we can also work together with the government regulatory bodies from around the world. So we meet with the requirement with the technology in region to develop the latest wireless communication related 
drug use policy, and also with great pleasure, we can see ITOI is now starting its work on the early vision of 6G wireless communication. So I think here we can either contribute from technical vision, what will 6G look like, and also the relevant spectrum regulatory policy, which will provide a sustainable supply of spectrum for the future development of ICT development. And more importantly, if you have all these elements, the industry need to join ITD's activity and the strategic initiative to bring all these things into realization in different regions, different countries. For one thing, technology like 5G, AI, cloud, edge computing, internet of things will all be very useful in different scenarios that will satisfy the requirement from different countries and regions in the world, whether they are developed countries, developing countries, or less developed countries. So to wrap up, so the industry sector, the private sector, all together, we can play multiple roles in bringing our contributions to benefit ICT development on the platform provided by ITU and the whole.